to me, FAB is an opportunity to gather with women from all around the community and really celebrate the accomplishments of, of women in our community and around the state of Wyoming. So Kristen is a mover and a shaker. Um, she makes things happen. I keep saying her today, I said, look around, look what you've done. She connects people in ways that I find really inspiring. Um, I haven't known her a whole long time and already I feel like I'm connected to a whole different group of women in this community. And she gets us moving and making change. Kristen is amazing. She's someone that I think is a great role model for all of us as leaders and someone that just does an amazing job for our community and the state as well. I adore Kristen Sabin. She's been nothing but supportive of SAGE and I think she's an important figure in our community. She's open, she's honest, she's professional and uh, I'm a big fan of hers. Kristen means the world to Sheridan. I don't think that they um, can appreciate or know how much that she does. Um, that she's brought so many great um, ideas and energy. I adore her. I'm so proud of her doing this event. She's one of my civic buddies. Um, we are in civic leadership together and she has stepped up as such an amazing leader. You know, this is a Herculean task to put this whole event on and um, I'm, I just saw her. I'm proud that she's still upright. Um, she's she's an amazing woman and she's taken this on. I'm also proud of her um, for raising $40,000 to bring in our the keynote speaker. I'm Kristen Saban and I'm the publisher at the Sheridan Press and the uh, chair of the FAB Women's Conference Committee. That's a lot. FAB Women's Conference is a day where we gather women from all across the state to try to get everybody in a room, network, empower each other, get some ideas going, and just have a good time. It's the most crowded fab that we've had so far. Um, we have a huge name speaker in town and everybody's kind of keeping an eye out for her. She ducked away for a little bit after signing some books for us. Um, but she'll be back this afternoon. We have a great day ahead of us and I'm just really stoked. The biggest thing is just to recognize all of the incredible people that live here and all of the awesome things they do. One of the biggest parts of the lunch is to recognize our Woman of the Year. Uh, but we also have seven other women who are going to get celebrated today as part of that and they're just all huge contributors to the community and it's awesome.